tracking a cool night as clouds keep us above freezing and low near 38 tonight with a chance of a spot shower east of Highway 63. Tomorrow is going to be a cool day. We're going to stay in the low 40s through the afternoon and fall into the 30s by evening. Eventually, as this cold front clears the area, we'll finally get some clear skies by tomorrow night and some more sunshine by Sunday. Here's the hour by hour forecast. The rest of this evening, I'm expecting clouds through tomorrow as the front moves through. Winds will shift to the north, giving us cooler temperatures. Then for Sunday, we'll see some more sunshine for the afternoon. That should warm us back close to 50. We get even warmer Monday and Tuesday as I'm tracking gusty winds that get us into the 50s. By Wednesday, another front will move through and this will be the transition period as some much colder air moves in behind that. We do have a chance for a few showers on Wednesday, but after that, some much colder air starts to move in. It's dry, cold and sunny for Christmas Eve and Christmas Day, and I'm not expecting those temperatures to last too long, but just enough to give us a very chilly holiday. Here's that temperature tracker as that front comes through. I'm expecting us to cool down during the day tomorrow. Then by Monday and Tuesday, we warm up just a little bit with those gusty winds from the south. Our next front moves through on Wednesday, really bringing in that cold Arctic air from the north. By Christmas Eve, we are down to the teens to start off the day. Temperatures only make it to the 20s for highs, and we'll be starting off in the teens, getting up to about 30 degrees on Christmas Day. So it's cold for the holiday. After that, though, we continue to warm up next weekend, looking a little bit warmer. So here's that breakdown for Christmas Eve and Christmas Day. Upper 20s to around 30 degrees both days for highs. Expecting sunshine, but those low temperatures will be quite cold, falling into the teens across most of the area. So we'll enjoy the mild weather, especially to start off early next week.